Yo, what is going on everybody? Welcome to the new YouTube video. Today I'm going to show you how to make a lot of money on customs without risk of dying. Let's get right into it. So one of the best ways to earn money on customs is to lose secret stashes. There's 15 of them in total. Some of them are a little harder and more trickier to find than others, but all in all, it should be really easy once you remember their position. If you spawn near the red warehouse area or what I call the crossroads area, cross over the river and below these two pipes, you'll see two secret stashes. One in the bush and one right in front of it. So what you can usually find in those stashes are bullets, some really rare items like paracords, gas analyzers, statues, meds, food, a lot of quest items and a lot more really rare stuff. The best part about these is that not too many people know about them and 90% of the time, they're unlooted. Once you loot those two, follow the road until you see the bus station. Near the bus station, there will be three more stashes. The first one is located in the container and is the most common one. So you have to be careful that nobody's camping in. The second one is located near the road below the pipe inside of a car tire. It is pretty low key so a lot of people don't even see it. You have to be careful on this area since there are usually one or two scavs that spawn here. The third one is located in the woods to the left. Just follow the green wall. Walk straight and you'll notice it right in front of you. There are also two more stashes pretty close by. One is by the railway, to the side, by the pole. The other one is by the gas station, and some people like the campus, so you gotta be a little bit careful. I forgot this one when I was recording the gameplay, so I'm adding it extra. There's another stash by the gas station, but I don't recommend it. The position is pretty bad, and you'll have to go through the actual gas station, which means you have to fight at least one PMC or a scab. Sometimes, even a scab boss, aka Rishala. This stash is located below the pipe, similar like the one next to the bus station, but this one is in the bush. Once you looted the previous gas station stash, go up on the hill where there's a big power line. Before you go to the stash, I usually check this big weapon box for an extra weapon. Once you take it, there's a stash right next to the blue fence. Once you look at that one, pull out a blue fence and go straight. You'll see a small rock, go a bit to the right and you'll notice another stash in a bush. After that, go a little bit to the right, then straight down the woods. On the right side, you'll notice another one by the trees. Last one in this area is down the road, to the left, and behind the trash. Sometimes there's even a chance for you to get a weapon from these, 
So it is really good to go with a pistol only and just farm the weapons, farm the loot and get as much money as you can. Last four are located in the factory area. I usually watch out for the sniper's cab on the left and one in the tower on the right side. Once you reach the scav checkpoint, go to the right, but keep the left side of the road. You'll notice another stash by the wall inside the bush. Turn around, go back to the scav checkpoint and through the hole in the wall. Once you go through, turn left and you'll see an exit called admin gate. There's a stash in the corner next to it. Now walk down that road and you'll notice another stash in the bush next to the ZB 1011 exit. There are two more stashes left. One is behind the ZB 1011 exit behind the pipes. Last stash is located on the other road where the admin gate is. Go straight through the gate and go left. The stash is located in a hole. Be careful though, there are a lot of scavs around here so I would avoid this one unless you spawn here. There's also a sniper on that chimney up there so be careful that you don't get shot and die. That is it for today's video. If you want to see more Tarkov tips and trick videos, please leave a like and comment down below. Don't forget to also subscribe and turn on the bell for the future notifications. I'll see you all in the next video. Good luck with the raids and peace out.